Hello and welcome to Yalquai Gaming, where we are playing Ark, and today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to be... No? Cool. I earned some Xbox points. <laughs> Fair enough. Today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. Today I am going to be trying to finally build a proper house. Something a little bit bigger than this. So that means I'm going to be spending a lot of time resource gathering, which I am going to cut. So this is going to be the first time I do like editing and that type of stuff in the ARC playthrough. So first things first is we need to gather a ton of resources because I want to be a building out of stone. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to make a lot of mess, like a, just a lot of cock ups doing this the first time. So First things first, yep, let's get some resources gathered and then we can try and pick a good spot to put our little new house down. We'll fly around and do some exploring as well, have a look for somewhere cool to live. So, resources first though, because it is almost, I was going to say it's almost night time, but it's not, it's morning. Alright, sod that then. Where is our flyer? Let's just move him a little bit. And let's get on our flyer. Oh, he's got a level as well. Right. Let's give him some stamina. So, where to live, where to live, where to live? That's the question, isn't it? I wanted somewhere that was a decent size of open space. I mean, up here is actually pretty cool. With like a path going up it there. I could live up here. It's a bit far from water though, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's a little bit far from the water. Hmm. Right, let's let him get some stamina back and then we'll have another look around. I was actually thinking down by the beach, but... Hmm. It's difficult. It's difficult to think of a good place to park ourselves. This is where we found our Spinosaur, isn't it? Uh, it's a bit, it's quite a big area, but it's just mostly water. There's not really any land. Ah, it's a snake. Don't go land over there. <laughs> right, let's land and we'll grab our birdie some food by killing this little thing, probably. Kill them. There we go, yeah, they're gonna attack me. I'm pretty sure you can beat them, so. Maybe not. Oh, it's off. Ha! I can fly though. You horrible little bastard. Right. Bit of stamina back. I mean, what's on our. M oh, we can't really see the map from here, can we? Uh, hmm. It's difficult because I want somewhere with a decent enough, enough amount of space. But at the same time, I don't want to be too far from things like water and stuff. And we haven't actually gone over this way yet, so we could just have a look around. Exploring is good. What are these things? Are they... Predators? That bird thing looks aggressive. Hi guys, are you friendly? Alright, you're friendly. What about you? I mean, looking at those claws, I do not think you're friendly. Alright, never mind. Ooh, another one of the big horse things. That I have a technical name that I've forgotten already. Right, so this is like a mangrove swamp, isn't it? Oh, that's cool. That's going to have some horrible stuff in it. Oh! Is that another spine? It is, isn't it? That's another spine I saw. Let's not go near that then. Hmm. Uh, 
Oh, no, no, where are you taking me? Yep, you don't like landing in the water. I don't like being in the water. Why have you dropped me off here? Where have you gone? Right, uh... That didn't work. Shit. Ah! Ah! Spider the snake! Crocodile fuck! Run! Oh no, not good, not good, not good. Death. Lots of death. Oh no! No, what a shit way to die. Oh, the crocodile's leaving, but the snake's coming. Look, I see it. No! Crocodile, come and eat the snake! Nope, everyone's just gonna eat me. Fair enough. Cool. Cool. Yep, fuck. That went well. <laughs> okay. That was a good start. Maybe I'll just build here. This is actually quite a decent amount of space. It's got access to the water. Like right here. Maybe I'll take this down and just start try and build a house here. Just like a little starting house type thing. Not something super duper. Just a, a home. And the house could be like here, and then you could have a pen. That might be the best option, since apparently everything is horrible and dangerous over there. Oh, we're going to need to go back and get all our stuff. What's the best way to do that? Probably Steve. Oh, for fuck's sake, small dinos. I think Steve's probably going to be the best way of getting back all of our stuff. Oh, we need a better flyer as well. One that doesn't just deposit us on the ground every five seconds because it's run out of stamina. <laughs> right. Okay, we use Steve, we go get our stuff and we build a house down here because we need like a bed and all that type of stuff. We need to be a bit more... a bit more prepared. Yeah, you know, just a bit more setup. I I did try and put that um, saddle on this thing, which was cool. But I realised that the storage boxes don't actually help. You can't just carry shit tons of stuff with it. So that made me sad. <laughs> uh, Steve, you can have a point in health because you're super important. And if you die, I will be upset. Right, let's get Steve into the water and then we can go get our stuff back and then try and build a house. That went f swimmingly well. Um, I am thinking maybe just the end of this beach might be the best option. Just for now, just to start with. Uh, there's probably a better place considering I think I'm maybe in the mid game I don't know if I've actually reached the mid game yet I don't feel like I'm in the early game anymore but I don't know enough about the game to actually be able to properly tell you if I am in the mid or the late game uh, sorry the mid or the early game I'm definitely not in the late game get your stamina back. oh wow he gets his stamina back really quickly in the water Okay. So. It's just through here, isn't it? The swamp. Because this is where we fought Spinosaur, the first Spinosaur. Yeah, here's the mangrove swamp. Which we know has a Spinosaur in it, so we need to be really careful. Another snake over there. The snakes are fucking horrible. That's a frog. That is a frog. Oh no, Steve! 
Kill the snakes. Kill it. Kill it. Kill them all. Haha! -ha. Bastards. Should we try and get the Spinosaur while we're here? If we can get back to our flyer, we might be able to get the Spinosaur. That's just typical, isn't it? I'm like, so today we're gonna build a house, and then five minutes in, I'm dead and trying to tame a Spinosaur. Oh god! Oh god! Steve! Steve, where are you? Ah! I don't know what happened. Steve killed it, though. So can those things knock me off my mount? Oh, fuck off. Where's my body? Oh no, this thing's attacked. Is it a Baryonyx? That's a Baryonyx. Can Steve kill a Barry? Yeah! Steve's awesome. That's a snail. Okay. Can I tame the snail? I'm scared of getting off. I'm gonna put some points into my health. <laughs> Hi, snail. What's this? Oh, paste. Oh god, frog of death, frog of death, frog of death. Okay, no, that, that frog's not painful. <laughs> I don't like the swamp, I wanna get out of the swamp. No, 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 no. There's my stuff. Another snake. Oh, and there's the crocodile. Right. Right, shit. No, it's that thing. That thing gets me off the fucking mount. No! Oh, fuck you. Well, this is going just swimmingly. Yeah, thank you. You summed it up there, mate. Okay. What level am I? 60. Saddles. What saddles have I unlocked now, then? Nothing that I've got, basically. Uh, yeah, because I think Spino is 71 and Alice, sorry, 67. So I'm still quite far away from being able to ride either of those two monsters. Okay, alright. Let's just go for it, maybe. No, 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 that was a bad idea. Okay, no, that's not aggressive. The stingrays are aggressive, though, aren't they? Ugh, oh, just thinking maybe just leg it. If we can get to where Steve is, we should. Steve should be able to protect us, because I'm going to guess he's already killed that thing. Maybe. Hopefully. Oh, piss off, you small little bastard. This is going very poorly. All I want to do is build a house. That is literally all I wanted to do today was try and build myself a beautiful home. And instead, <laughs> I've died twice within the first 15 minutes.
I can't stop moving or they'll eat me. <laughs> I just want to be able to ride Spinosaurus and then I'll be fine. <laughs> Probably. Not if stuff can just turn up and knock me off my mount though. That that was new and not welcome at all. I think I'm going in the right direction. Maybe turn left a little bit. It's just past the red one, isn't it? So up by the red one, maybe it's down this cliff here. Ugh. Oh, piss off! Oh god, wonderful. Um, is there a way down? No, there's not a way down! No! This is going tremendously well. <laughs> Alright. Alright. We might need another flyer. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. I am highly disappointed in myself right now. Just, I'm sorry guys, I am very sorry. I I am not doing well today. <laughs> There's an army of small bastards following me now. Look, look how happy they are. Just bouncing along happily little. Ugh. I will punch you to death. Probably not, to be honest, because you actually scare me when I don't have any equipment. But you will follow me and my Spinosaurus will eat you. All right. Chops, the second. Oh no, they've stopped following me, that's fine. He's very happy about that, that's adorable. Chops, the second, is not good enough to take me all the way there, I don't think. So. My only real option is to take Barry or capture another flyer, but it'll take me so long to make the stuff to capture another flyer that I just can't be bothered. Why is Barry so slow? He is very. He seems slower in the water than on land. Die. I didn't even kill it, did I? That's alright, that's not the point. The point is we need to go and get our stuff back. Yeah, Barry's actually quite fast on land, but he always seem, he seems really slow in, in the water. Unless that's just because I'm comparing him to uh, Steve, who is lightning in the water. Okay. Alright. We're not going to die four times. We can't die four times. That's just too much. That's too embarrassing. Is that our death thing there? No, that's this death, isn't it? That's this time. So that's not what we want. What we want is to very carefully, maybe, please don't die from doing this. I'm really sorry about this, Barry. There we go. Ah, there's a path here. Okay, there is a path. So we go down the path. And then we find where Steve is. And Steve is right on top of our first body. Maybe we skirt around the forest? There's, there's one of our bodies. Did you guys eat it? Did you eat me? Horrible creatures. I do wonder how effective you can make an entire army of them. Snake! 
Right, yeah, so if we skirt the edge of the... Is this is this the Redwoods that someone mentioned that I should go to? If we sort of skirt... Because I think our body's over on that beach there. Um, yeah, Barry did okay in, on land, actually. What are you? I'm gonna eat you. There we go. Right, so we go down here and we skirt the edge of this forest a little bit. Ah, shit. No, it still wants us to go into what is essentially a swamp. And there, look, what's that in the water? Another crocodile. Multiple crocodiles. Yeah, that's a Steve. Two Steves. Are they they're not are they full Steve? They are full Steves. Okay, we don't want to go anywhere near two Steves, they will wreck us. Um Can we go down here maybe? Okay. And then across here. So we need to stay on the land as much as possible. Steve's got the, the the crocodiles down here have definitely got the advantage in the water. Right, that thing over there is what knocks us off our mount, I'm pretty sure of it. That that thing there by the rock. So Oh look, it's a small crocodile. Oh god! No, <laughs> Barry! Barry, I love you! No! Barry, help me! Ah, oh, there's so much stuff! Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> I don't know if I should laugh or cry. This is the worst thing ever! We've now lost... <laughs> Wings. Steve. <laughs> and Barry, and I don't know where I am. Okay, I know where I am now. <sighs> For fuck's sake. Right, no, that's it, that's enough. We, we, this is not going well, clearly. We're gonna make ourselves a bowler. We've got some t tranquilizer arrows, we've got a bow. Um, yeah, we, we're just going to capture a flyer and fly back. <sighs> Fuck's sake, it's going to gonna need the hide. Uh, maybe one of our predators has got some hide in it. Um, okay, yeah, we, we, we just have to get another flyer and take that because this is just stupid now. Just throwing ourselves again and again and again at something that we just can't handle. And I've lost Bonnie's husband. I'm sorry, Bonnie. I'm sorry, Bonnie. It doesn't look like I'm actually going to get to do any of the editing. Oh, oh no, chops. Um, hmm. I think I've set them all too aggressive again, haven't I? Yeah, the hotkeys changed back when I rejoined this game. So that's just annoying. Um, I had removed this whistle all aggressive hotkey, but it's put itself back there. So whistle all neutral hyphen. Hyphen, shit, what's a hyphen? Um. Right, that's aggressive. That's neutral. That, that should be all neutral now then. 
Oh, Ali, why can't I ride you? Look how amazing you are, level 50! At least you got some hide for me, Ali. Thank you. Are you following me? You shouldn't be. Oh, I don't know anymore. Everything's kind of, uh... Up in the air from what's happening, right. Okay. Bonnie, do you have any hide? You do, okay, cool. So we can maybe make a, a saddle for one of the flyers. We should have a bow and some arrows somewhere. Oh, we've got more saddles, right, okay. What were they called? Petro Petrodon? No, let's get one before we actually start trying to make shit. I am not knowledgeable enough at this game to start just crafting stuff and hoping for the best. I'm sure I had a spare bow. Apparently not. Okay. Wood, stone and thatch I need, right? Yeah, I collected some wood when I got the uh, the big guy with the um, thing on his on his back, but it yeah, he wasn't very good at it to be honest. I think I need to get an actual crafting, an actual collect a resource collecting dinosaur, one that's job is to do that. But uh, there we go. Right, let's put this stuff back. And then see if we can't get ourselves another flyer to sort this shit out. Spino is very cool. I have a feeling I could let Al just wander, to be honest. I'm going to let Al do what he wants. I'm going to change him to aggressive. And I'm going to let him wander. There we go. Yeah, I'm going to let Al just chill. I don't know how far he'll go. Oh, he's off. Wait a second. Will he kill that if I try and take it out? Yeah, he probably will, actually. Yep, shit, everything kills it. No. <laughs> oh, you're all still aggressive as well. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, if I do that, what's your behavior set to now? Right, and what, she, what are you set to? Neutral, okay. No, I'm, Al, I'm sorry, come here. You're going to kill everything that I need to collect. <laughs> I shouldn't have done this. Uh, neutral. Al, you murdering bastard, come here. Right. Neutral. Why were you not set to neutral? There we go. Okay. Right, just stay here for a minute. Jesus, you're violent. They killed a level 12 flyer that I probably wanted. Actually, I need some meat from him, don't I, if I want to tame another flyer. Oh, God, everything's staring at me. Yeah, yeah, I get it. You're angry. Stay. Oh. I don't know how long I've got until I lose all my stuff. Which is frustrating. Um, where's a flyer? <sighs> right, we get ourselves another flyer and we get over there and we grab our stuff, tell the dinosaurs to follow us and then get the hell out of there. Hopefully it'll work. But it, this has just been a failure entirely. Get out of my fucking dodo. Uh, 
Have we have they killed the only flyer that's around here now? I feel like the answer is yes. And I'm very upset by that. Oh, for God's sake. No, no, you come here. Well, that failed miserably. Please go night night. I can't see it because of the sun. Oh no, it's falling into the water for fuck's sake. I am not strong enough to drag it out. It's just going to die under here. Um. Yeah, oxygen is just going to die. Stupid fucking bird. Well, this is going incredibly successfully. Just this whole episode is just going brilliantly. Yeah. Look at me. I am amazingly pro. Uh, okay. Right. I'm going on foot again. Sod it. We figured out there's a path now, so we shouldn't at least um, fall to our death. But this is just becoming silly. I, I just need to get my stuff back. And I need to get at least one of those dinosaurs back. But this is just fucking ridiculous now. All I wanted was to build a house. Oh. But no, there is no house. There will never be a house. I will die homeless and unshaven. I know you can make scissors, but I kind of like the hair. It's pretty cool. Just da -da 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 -da. Run through the jungle of death. Um... Maybe, 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 maybe the dinosaurs killed the threats that are down there. Uh, apart from these little ones, obviously. Oh no, I'm going the wrong way again, aren't I? There's a path down here. We will learn from mistakes. Each time we attempt this, it will go slightly better. Or worse. Probably worse. I think we'd have been fine if that thing couldn't knock us off our mount. Which, obviously, is the point of why it can knock us off our mount. Oh no, and I'm hungry as well. No, fuck off. Oh. For the love of God. Right. Okay. We run. We grab the stuff. We get out of there. It might be successful. Is our flyer dead? That's a good question. I was killed, I was killed, I was killed, I was killed. Yeah, that's fine. So, all our dinos are still alive. Which means our flyer is down there somewhere. Oh, I'm starving to death. Wonderful. Um... There we go. Oh, I shouldn't starve to death now. I should just dehydrate instead. Nope, nope. Learn from mistakes. Oh, God's sake. Yeah, I know. I'm dehydrated and I'm hungry. Everything is going wrong. Leave me alone. Angry red letters. No! Fuck! Oh, I survived. Cool. Water, water, water. 
Please don't have a Spinosaurus in you. There we go. Right. What's that? It's a crocodile, it's not Steve. It's a Steve, but it's not the Steve. On land, we can avoid the crocodiles. The snake, snake, snake. I can't sprint, I can't sprint, I can't sprint. The snake. No. Oh god, it's right there. What is that? That's a baryonyx. Why do I have like a leech on me? Oh my... Cool. Just fucking cool, yeah. At what point do I just give up and just decide all that stuff's lost? Like genuinely at what point do I just say fuck it? Because this is just becoming a joke now. Like I physically can't get to that stuff. Maybe if I tame a flyer. Maybe. Maybe. But I'm fairly certain I was carrying on my hide just then when I died. Okay, so what is that? Oh, it's the, it's the thing. It's it's the long neck thing. That's fine. I didn't. See, it was at an angle, so I thought it was like stood on its back legs. I thought some sort of fucking T Rex or something would come to say hello. Hi everyone. Um, your husband's dead. Uh, I mean, I could take Ali with me. It's getting dark now as well. Fuck. Duh, duh. 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 Right. Bow. Did I take the hide with me or not? I have some of it here at least. I don't think I need that. I have regular arrows and I have drugs. Right. It's getting dark. Oh, I'm not going to be able to do this. I'm going to lose all that stuff. Which isn't the end of the world, but losing the dinosaurs is. If I don't get them, I don't know how long they can keep themselves there for. How do I cancel you? Yeah, go away. Right. Um... I, I can't do it, can I? This is just, yeah. I'm gonna have to leave them there until I can get better stuff. Until I can actually get like a saddle on a decent dinosaur and get over there again. I don't have a flyer. There's just no point in me banging my head against it and again and again and again. If they die, they die. It's, yeah, that's awful, but yeah, I don't have a choice. Alright, I'm going to put my stuff away and I'm going to make some new tools because I have enough metal. <sighs> Alright, craft one of them, craft one of them. We'll go for a sword this time instead. So we got axe, pickaxe. Sword, uh, sword, 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 sword. Um, crossbow. And scythe. 
then we locked we unlocked some new armor, didn't we? So like a uh, oh, so I can select it for just for the island. That's cool. Right, so we've got our hide equipment here, and then the ghillie equipment, which keeps you cool and hidden. Um, Chitin armor, which makes you war makes you a bit warm, but gives you physical protection. And is that the only equipment I can make at the moment? Huh. So I can put that on my gun, that's cool. Advanced pistol. Flak chest plate. Fibre hide and metal crafted at the smithy. Makes the elements harder to endure. Should we should we get this? Ooh, an assault rifle. Right, okay, there's a lot of stuff that we've got, like, that we just haven't played with yet. A refrigerator. Requires electricity. We need to make a base so we can get, like, electricity and guns and stuff, but... Let's... Unlock armor. Why not? Because that looks, that looks really badass. And we need new clothes, so. So we've got um, chest, boots, gloves, helmet. And what are we missing for the legs then? Hide, I guess. We've got some here. There we go, legs. All right, I mean, yeah, why not? This will keep us a bit safer, um, hopefully. Let's have a look how it looks as well. This will be cool. All right, that's badass looking. Uh, why did that fire go out? Oh, is it run out of fuel? <sighs> okay. Do we have some fuel in this one at least that we can take out? Yeah, we can make some more of this. If we have to, yeah. So let's just eat some food and put this in here. Okay. So, again, looking at all the engrams, because we've just not been unlocking stuff, which is really stupid. Um. Hmm. So we've got like wooden chairs and stuff, but I'm not really sure how useful that is. Increased meat capacity. Huh. Bookshelf. Not super useful maybe. I don't I don't know, it might be. Um yeah, let's just turn it onto the island. Right. So we want our stone stuff really as well. We're gonna make stuff out of stone. Stone wall, stone foundation, stone ceiling, door frame, reinforced door, stairs. We get triangle stuff as well. Ah, oh, window frame, yeah sure. And then we've got roofs. Don't know if that's big enough for the massive dinosaurs to come through. Right. A behemoth. Is that the best? Is that the biggest one then? So, I mean, we're going to need it. We'll get a toilet as well. 
And then we've got the guns and stuff, but I'm not going for that just yet. Um, right, greenhouse stuff, I, I don't know what that's useful for. Metal doors and walls, which I'm going to guess are even stronger, but I don't think that's something I really need right now. Electrical stuff, okay. Uh, fabricator, we're going to need this, aren't we? Electronics and polymer, probably. And an electrical generator. Huh. Um. Don't know what that does. <laughs> Huh, cool, so that lets me know where I am on the map. Bunk bed. Okay. More guns, which, again, not really going to go for just yet. And then we've got a refrigerator, which, yeah, we'll probably need. And then all this stuff, which... I don't know what it is, but it's starting to look like just really big saddles, a better bow, a sniper of some sort, gas mask, rocket launcher, I'm going to guess, big sword, um, the best armor maybe, and then the best stuff for the final dinosaur maybe. Right. Well, overall, that was an absolute mess, to be honest. We lost a ton of stuff, but we have a sword and some better armor now, so that's kind of cool. I'm going to collect some resources. Um, actually, I'm going to go and take down the old base, drop everything onto the ground, take it apart and whatnot. Let's just take everything out of chops, other than some berries for him to eat. And then we'll ride him down there. Oh, of course. So we're going to ride him down to the, the first place where we lived. We're going to take that all apart. Put some chests on the ground and just start maybe collecting resources. And thinking about where we're going to put our actual house and how the whole thing works together. So how much space are we going to need? That's a good question. Probably a lot more space than we've already got, but not stupid amounts of space, I guess. Because what we've already got functions as everything. I'm thinking we're going to need a storage room, a crafting room, a kitchen, and a bedroom. But that doesn't all have to be on the same floor. The bedroom, for example, can be on the second floor. If we can build multi-story buildings, I'm not sure about that. Actually, can you build a floor? Or does it have to be a ceiling? Hmm. Huh. So how does it work? Wooden ceiling. Oh, it doubles as a floor. Alright, I'm an idiot. Fair enough. I mean, we already knew that. I should have got. I should have brought both uh, chopses with me to act as carriers for this. Just traveling in the dark is an absolute pain, isn't it? Everything in the dark is an absolute pain. I don't think chops are very fast, so I'm just going to tell him to follow me and. Passive, yeah, that's neutral, that's fine. Okay, let's go, chops. Fuck off, Dodo. How far into the water can I build? That's a good question. Um, right, so... 
rocks around here aren't super common, are they? Uh, there's obviously this massive one here, which you can get some of. Although I think I have to go into the water for that, don't I? And it's not letting me. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay. Let's see. It's quite difficult to see. Are you are you a mineable rock? Nope. For fuck's sake. I mean, this place isn't going to work if I can't find stones. Is it? Uh, There's obviously the ones down here, maybe. So we're going to have to load ourselves and chops up, and then that should be enough to at least start maybe looking at a bit of a foundation. You're tired. Stop moving. I know I'm tired. I'm tired of dying. Ugh. Not a successful start to this episode at all. Wait, why have I got stars? Why am I stunned? Is it because I'm tired? Can I, like, work myself into exhaustion? Huh. It'd be cool if you could. That'd make a lot of sense if you could. Hmm. Here we go. We're gonna need to get a massive dino to just transport rocks around. It just takes forever to collect enough stone. So what is it I actually need to make stone walls? Stone, thatch and wood. But we're gonna want um, foundations, aren't we? So it's got the triangle ones and the square ones. It's just still stone, thatch, and wood. All right. Okay. So we'll need to get ourselves some thatch and some wood as well. I think maybe we run around, we craft the stuff, and then we put the stuff straight into chops. We'll go get the other chops as well, because we're basically back at the fucking base now. So we just run around with both chopses, and maybe even Spike, just run around with a bunch of stuff following us, because that's kind of what we need to be doing. Okay, now, so now I can go stone, foundation, yeah, craft two, why can't I craft any more than two? God knows. Right, and get a lot more thatch, do you, than wood. Oh, hi, Al. Actually, Al's got a shit ton of carry away. Let's get Al to follow us. I mean, realistically, I could just get everything to follow me while I do this. It wouldn't really hurt in any way, would it? Stone. So what is it I'm lacking? Oh, a bit of everything now. Cool. Right, Al. God, you're scary. Uh, follow me. And we're gonna start buffing your melee damage a little bit, I think. Calm down. Al is horrifyingly strong, I think. Okay, and pickaxe, get a bit of thatch. Stone. It's just stone. We need so much more stone than this. Oh, there's that patch up there, isn't there? That's a good idea. Let's go and collect. Why are we not bringing this guy as well? He's got the biggest carry weight. Yeah, this thing's got the carry weight. I'm an idiot. This thing's got a thousand carry Are you... Oh god, you're jumping around a lot. Are you empty? No, you're not empty, so we need to empty you, and that'll give you a bit more carry weight. Uh, 
Yeah. I'm happy to just drop everything at the moment. Right, now how are you doing? Is it this thing on top of you? Is that actually... Oh, that has a lot of health. Um, demolish, there we go. Ah, we should have just demolished all of them if we get resources back for it. Now, how are you doing? Still pretty much the same. Okay. Why are you stuck? Right, so if we ride this guy over to the big patch of rocks I saw with Al basically got his head up his ass. Maybe just tell him to follow us, because otherwise he's otherwise we can't collect stuff as we move. Yeah, you follow us, and then we can collect rocks as we go. Oh god, it's very shaky. Oh, the sun's coming up, thankfully. Finally, thank god. Nope, the sun is not coming up, it's just the tiny bit of light is reflecting off these guys. And I'm starving, wonderful. Um, chops, I'm gonna take your berries. No! Shit, I dropped them, I'm not very clever. There, there they are. Whee! Alright, there you go. How are you doing for food? Fine for now. You're fine, you're full of uh, meat. I think I should have got and brought. I should have brought a lot of cooked food with me, really. I think doing all this physical stuff takes a lot of um, burns your hunger really quickly, maybe. I mean, I can go back if I need to. It's fine. Uh. Thanks, guys. <laughs> So when they're following me, they seem pretty good at defending me. Yeah, my food's empty again. And we're encumbered, so let's... Turn everything into foundations. And then we'll run back. Why can't we build any more? Still not enough stone, fair enough. Chops, you can carry these. Right, let's go back and get some food then. <sighs> There's a lot of rocks here as well that we can use. And to be honest, I think I'm only going to need like 20 or so foundations. It's walls and stuff I'm going to need a lot of. But we'll still go up to that patch and get all the rocks because, you know, we just need them. We might soon be able to ride Ali or the Spino. I think it's only eight more levels for Ali, isn't it? That would be good. Once I can ride Ali, I might consider myself safe enough to go and um, reclaim our lost dinos. What? Chippy Dino level up zero, max level zero, plus get Chippy Dino to level two to advance. What? I don't know. I don't know what that means. That's fine. I don't know what a lot of things mean. Um, we'll drop off a lot of this stuff, actually. So we're just going to go out and get um, a ton of stone now. Can't drop off that, that's fine. Oh no, I made this to, as, a, as, as an extra. Right, and we'll bring enough food. 
Okay, cool. Right. So let's go up this cliff and get as much stone as we can manage before our pickaxe dies. Uh, our axe dies. Hatchet, even. Don't know how much we'll be able to get, but if we can get a couple of hundred, um, if we can use up the uh, hatchet and the pick, maybe, before we need to come back, that'd be really good. You're quite fast as well. Like You're fast enough. definitely think Ali with then like maybe a couple of the horse things following it as pack animals would be a really good mining convoy maybe yeah I'd, I'd like ride Ali and then have maybe like two or three of them following me okay and it's just up here isn't it just at the top of this hill where I think that there's an absolute ton of rock obviously we're walking past the rocks but Yeah, here we go. All of this stuff. I wonder if that annoying thing can knock us off the horse. Because the horse is massive. Alright, uh, okay. I don't think that we're going to level up super quickly, which is a shame. I don't think we're going to get to level... Um, 69 anytime soon. Are you proud of me? I took the high road and didn't make a joke about 69. But we'll see. Not about making the joke. That's clearly, that ship's clearly already set. We'll see about uh, getting to a good enough level, a high enough level. To oh, what? Okay, so yeah, I worked myself into unconsciousness. Fair enough, that's a thing. Ali going to defend me or eat me? <laughs> this would be a great opportunity for him to decide he doesn't want to work for me anymore. So when it says you're tired, you need to take a rest, it's being really fucking serious. Cool. There we go. Hi, guys. It's a bit kind of freaky that you do that. Right, so buffs to stamina are actually really important then, I guess. Buffing your stamina, and I wonder if melee damage actually affects how effective you are with the tools. That's something I would really like to know if anyone would mind answering me. If I buff my melee damage, does that make me more effective at using tools? Yeah, this, this place is good for stone. Um, so, the fabricator, I don't know how big that is. We might need to build one to see roughly how big it is. But that's obviously going to go in the workshop along with smithy um, and the workbench thing that we've already got. And then we're going to need a room for our generator because we're going to start using that. We're going to have to have a fridge for our food, and then maybe three fridges for dino food, one for meat, one for fish, and one for berries. And then a fridge for narco berries in the workshop. Obviously our mortar and pestle in the workshop. Uh, we'll put it into you first, because that's kind of your job, isn't it? Nice. Oh, look at that. Barely, barely affected him. So you're kind of here to guard, Al. Um, I think, I don't think I'm going to fill up uh, the pony one. I need to give that, I need to give it a proper name because I don't know what it is. I know what I'll call you. Come here. That's wrong. Options. Um, change name. Atlas. Yeah, we'll call him Atlas, the Greek uh, mythological character who holds up the world, because that's basically what he's doing for us. He's holding everything up. So he can be Atlas. Um, 
I'd really like to try and tame one of the long-necked ones. I wonder how much they can carry. I wonder how easy they are to tame, or difficult to tame. We could try it later, as like a bit of a... a break from doing monotonous building stuff. So... I th think I'd like a thousand stone if possible. Do you know, I don't know. I don't know if this guy can actually harvest rock. He is big. No, he cannot harvest rock. Oh well. That's a shame. There must be one. So I'm sure someone said in one of the comments that there's one that can harvest stone. So definitely will be something that we can get to make um, collecting rock a lot easier. Because this is not efficient at all. I'm scared that I'll whack one of them in the leg with my axe. I don't know what happens if you hit a dinosaur that you've tamed. Does it just take it or does it decide that it's not having that and kill you? <laughs> Let's eat something. Uh, we should have brought some water as well while we're here, but a bit late for that now. What do you think? Do you think with our new armor and sword we could uh, go and rescue our dinosaurs? I really don't know. How many is that then? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Alright, so we've got over a thousand stone here, and our axe is still doing alright, so we'll we'll keep going maybe until the axe dies. Um, and then we can lay at least sort of a foundational idea, we can have at least a foundational idea of what we're doing with our base. I don't know how enclosed the dinosaurs should be. Hmm. That's a good question. Ah, no, I'm not going to do that again. Let's just stick this stuff in here. Yeah, I don't know if all the dinosaurs should be in a pen. That'd need to be a really big pen, though. Or if just like my prey animals need to be in a pen. I think it'd be really cute to have a crash for the babies. I think that'd be adorable. But I think eventually you're gonna have so many of them that there's no point putting them all in a pen. Maybe you just put them in a pen for breeding. Um, or to protect your weaker animals? Or do you just get like a pack of five alleys and tell them all to murder everything that comes near you? That might also be an option. <laughs> hmm. I definitely want a pen for my prey animals though. Because they're a bit of a flight risk sometimes, aren't they? This is the first time we've actually gone like properly resource collecting with a uh, diner following us. Oh, there it goes, it's broken. All right, cool. Um, get a little bit of flint while we're up here and then we'll make our way back collecting some thatch as we go. So, that's a cliff, we don't want to go down there. Where's the way down? Is it over here? Yeah, it's over here. Oh, we've got chops following us as well, I think. It was following us anyway. Yeah, chops there. Go on the chops the second. 
Where's Atlas gone? I have lost Atlas. How do you lose something that big? Where the f fuck has Atlas just gone? Where's the dinosaur carrying all of my stone just gone? Oh no. Where are you? Have you fallen down or something? Well, there's Al. There he is. There's Al. There's Atlas. So I'm going to guess they fell down. There we go. Chops is of less importance than these guys because these guys are carrying all the resources. Well, Chops is carrying a few. Um, a few foundations, so we'll try and keep him alive as well if we can. I wonder if maybe down here would be a good option. Actually, this little cove here. Because obviously it's got access to stone up the hill, there's trees everywhere. And it's only a two second fly away from... Away from that down there. Hmm. Probably better than being out on that spit of land. I think it might be actually. I think down here might be a good option. For our base. Let's bring everyone back and let's sort our resources out and then we'll figure it out and we'll have a sort of a think about it. Alright, Al, thank you very much for guarding me. That was very sweet of you. You can have a level up for that. Oh, hello. Um, Atlas, thank you for carrying everything. I going to have some trouble sorting this out now, aren't I? Dehydrated. Oh, hello. Uh, stop following me, and stop following me. Let's get some drink. And then we'll grab some wood and thatch. That's way too much thatch. And some wood. We'll try and we'll get on top of Atlas and we'll deal with it from there. Right. It's a good thing I can't be crushed under the weight of what I'm carrying. Um, foundations, craft 11. It's, yeah, so... We've got more than enough wood and stuff, it's just the stone, so now we can get a bit more stone out of... Atlas. Oh shit, I, I did a T. I don't know what T does. There we go, I'm pressing the wrong button. Right, let's get all this stone out and let's make some more. Okay, and craft one. Why can I only craft one? Wood! Oh, Alright, cool. Um, do you mind taking all of this back for a second then? Thank you. Actually, I bet you can, I bet you can get wood. Da, 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 da. It's very slow. Oh, it collects thatch primarily, not wood. Okay, well that's just not okay. Um, do you move around Spiner, please, not into Spiner? He will eat you. Look how hungry he looks looking at you. Right, we'll just get some wood out of the base then. Doop. Oh, is he following me still? I don't know what he's doing get as much wood as we can carry. That's more than we can carry. That's more than we can carry. 
Still more than we should fucking carry. There we go. There we go. Now, we can make eight more foundations. That should be all the stone we've got. So we should kind of now maybe be able to think about placing stuff down. Yeah, that's all the stuff. Right, you can have... Oh, sugar. You can have this back. Cool. And what level am I now? 62! Or is it 63 when I click that? 63! Ah, Alright, cool. So we're almost there. Now you have six more. Okay! Yeah, he thinks he, he still thinks he should be following me. No, don't jump on my house, you crazy bastard. Reverse. There we go. There we go. Okay, so apparently we're going to need some sort of uh, way of jumping off these tall ones. <laughs> Right, what I want to know is whether or not I can put foundations into the water. Because what I'm thinking is having our dinos come in along here. So if I put you there. And I put you uh, here. One, two, three. Right, and have this as the start of the workshop. So you're pulling up, so your dinos can walk up here, maybe like a window or something here. So then you've got. Um, no, 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 get out of the wall. So then you've got one. Okay, so no, I can't actually put it into the water. Okay. Right. But I can put it in the water, as, but it's too shallow. Right, okay, that, so that just doesn't work, does it? Um, Right, so if I'm going to build it, the water's going to end up being in the middle there. Shit, I can't pick this one up. Okay. This is going to be interesting then. You only have a few seconds to pick stuff up. And then it takes a lot longer to build. A lot more stuff to build than I thought it would. Honestly, maybe I shouldn't be building with stone. Maybe I should be building with thatch and wood and then like upgrading it afterwards. That might actually be a really good idea. I'm an idiot. Like how much thatch does it take to to make some of this to make some thatch ones? I know it takes a lot of fiber, but I've got my scythe here, haven't I? Right, and then pickaxe. Right, and then... So I can make three of them already. Yeah, it's, it needs a bit of wood. Alright, okay, we're going to make a ton of these instead. And we're going to try and design it roughly with thatch stuff first. Rather than being a muppet and doing that. Because that was just a massive waste of resources. Yeah, that was stupid. Because we can have, we can actually build over the water, it'll just have to be one block high, like on pillars. That could be cool. I have no idea what I'm doing. 
absolutely no idea what I'm doing here. Right, so we've got wood and... We've got some wood in you, haven't we? Let's take the wood out of you. And then... Look at that, 27 of them straight away. That's much better. And then we can just upgrade them once we're happy with the layout. Just have to sort of sit here and wait now, do I? And watch my... Uh... The weight's actually going up, not down. That's not good. Would you like this stone? That one. Can I move now? Nope. Cool. <laughs> How is the weight going up? In fact, would you also like this? There we go. I can move now. Move! Da -da -da -da. I just want to repair my axe while I'm doing this. There we go. Alright. And repair. And I'm starving. Oh no, I've got food here. There we go. Okay. So we've got an absolute bunch of them here. 30. Let's maybe make a few more. Yeah, we can make nine more. Yeah, that should do. Like that should totally do. Um Oh this is very stressful because I don't know what I need to be building so I don't know how big to build how small to build I'm glad that I can just replace the walls with better walls though that's kind of cool that is helpful and you go in there then you can go there right I can actually move at least now How's that? How's that level doing? Uh, I'm still, still debating going and trying another rescue attempt over there. I am still debating it. Okay, so. Hmm. What I'm thinking is. Making something down here, maybe. So if I go over to here, I'm not actually underwater, am I? That's fine. So like here. How far out can I go from there? Can I, I can't go there. No. But I can go... Right, it won't even let me connect to it on this side. All right, so we need to pick this one up. Hmm. Hmm. Right, all right, so let's try and have a look at this. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, and then we can't build one there. Yeah, this just isn't very good. Unless we make the workshop a bit longer. I don't like that, I can't place it there. I just don't like how this is going, to be honest. This just isn't working very well. Uh... What about around here? We've got a bit of an open space here. See, I can probably fence off, like, a massive area here, and it'll be really cool for them. They've got, like, a big wild space then. Because I can obviously wall here, so that's fine. Alright, let's go... Let's see, can I... If I go... How far out can I go? Not all the way out, which is kind of the problem. And how 
how far this way can I go? All the way this way, alright. Uh, pick them all up. And then try and put one here. Then how far out can I go? Ooh. Not at all, basically. Right, so. Hmm. I am really struggling to figure out what to do here. Let's just build something and see how it goes. Yeah, why not? We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Right, workshop. Um, then as far as we can go for here, so then this can be... Oh, it can go out here as well, though. There we go. Can we go along? No. Oh, no, we can. But not any further, alright. So we've got workshop and storage sort of here. Then, hmm. then upstairs we can have like the bedroom and the kitchen and whatnot. Yeah, that would work. Which means I need more resources. Maybe. Yeah, I do. All right, all right, all right. We can manage this. We can do this. I have a rough idea of what I'm doing, it's fine. I have no clue what I'm doing, it's not fine at all. I just want something a little bit nicer and a little bit stronger than a box. Oh hi big thing. I really want to tame you. Okay. Now then. Well. Let's craft a lot of walls and then we'll craft doors and stuff later on. Um. No, actually, I'm going to cancel that. Alright, so the wooden win- see, there's no thatch windows. Alright, so, craft two. So if I want to make that, I need to make- I need to go get some more wood. If I want to make things with windows. Okay. I really don't know what I'm doing here at all. I have like rough ideas, but just no real clue. I'm gonna make it one bigger. There we go. Right, then I want the window one. There and there. Then. And that's going to be another window one, so then I'll probably want one more on the end here. 
just to make it nice and more or less even. Alright, there's another window one there, okay. And then... We'll have our entrance here. Maybe. And we'll have another entrance here. I think. Alright, let's get some wood. Gonna need stairs and stuff, I think. And door frames and whatnot. I don't know if there is such a thing as the as a thatch stairs, so. So I'm gonna need two stairs. Yep, craft two. And then I'm gonna need one window. And I'm gonna need, for now, two doors. Okay. And then some walls. And obviously I'm gonna upgrade all of this so it's not uh, a motley of thatch and uh, wood. Because that doesn't look very nice at all, but for now, for now, it's going to have to do. So, we've got one, two, three. Hmm. So, a door goes here. But I don't think that's actually big enough. I want... Uh, no, it probably is. We have a dog over here. And then... We've got our workshop down here. So we have a door. We don't really need a door to get into our workshop. But, uh, yeah, let's have a door there. Which means it'll be wall... Have another door there. Then wall, wall, door. Okay. Right. So then we've got. Staircase. So this one's gonna have to be too tall because of how it works with the big storage things. If we do that, and then I need a ceiling. Don't have enough thatch. Um, okay, so it's gonna take a ton of resources just to upgrade this thing. But at least the, th the thatch was a decent idea, because trying to build it all straight away from stone would have been really stupid. Um, so once we've actually built ourselves a proper house, we can then start looking at building a, a pen for the dinos to go around it and stuff. So you go there, that's cool. And then ceiling. Just the one for now. Okay, and it goes there. And then stairs to go up to this floor. One and craft one. Okay, so there's the stairs up to the second floor, so that's cool. And I'm gonna have, I think, maybe the bathroom in here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have the bathroom in here. So we need a door. Door frame. Oh, we've got two, cool. So you go 
there. You go there, and then we'll need actually two more door frames. We only have enough to make two, which is fine. So then one goes there, and one goes there. Right, so we've got sort of a hall, an entrance area. We've got our bathroom. To be honest, this might make a nice little kitchen. This, yeah, this could be a kitchen. And then our workshop. And storage room. Yeah, we'll have this as the kitchen. And that as the bathroom. And then upstairs we'll have our bedroom. So I'm going to need to make a... I'm going to need to get a lot more thatch on for this. Right. Let's get to doing that then. Let's get some more thatch. Oh, I'm starving. Shit. Oh no, I have food in my winter. Should we take a break from crafting and see how the hell we tame this thing? No, that will not go well for me, will it? I, I feel like that's going to be a serious investment of time and resources to tame. Like, I know it's just sat there looking all innocent and cute, but... It's not going to be, is it? It's going to absolutely wreck me if I try it. Okay, and we're going to have to figure out how um, plumbing and whatnot works, because the toilet thing says it needs to be plumbed up. I don't know if I get any benefit at all from spending a ton of time and effort plumbing a toilet. But I'm going to spend a ton, ton of time and effort plumbing the toilet, just because I can and we need to figure out where the generator is going. Probably in the workshop, to be honest. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. What is this? Oh, hello. Are you going to try and hurt me? You seem to be aggressive. Monkey! Please stop following me. Like, just stop following me, go away. Alright, get him a little bit of wood and get some more fibre. The scythe, I, I joked about the scythe being useless, but it's actually quite handy. Right, and. Ooh, 60 of them. Nice. If we can keep collecting resources while we get. while we craft it as well, that'd be good. Um. I also don't think we can actually craft the saddles for the al alisaur. I have a feeling that might be made in the fabricator or something. Because we've unlocked the fabricator now, so I'm going to guess that the higher end dinosaur saddles need to be made in that, maybe. Maybe, 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 maybe. We'll have to see. Oh, we've only made 16 of the 60 walls, so this is actually going to take a while. We can go back and start placing the ones that we've made down, to be honest. I think it's not going to be a terrible little first house. I mean, I suppose technically it's our third house, but can we not call it that? Because that makes it sound a lot worse. First house sounds a lot better. <laughs> Alright, I don't think this is going to give us another level either, uh, which is a bit of a shame. If we want to level up, we need to go and get Steve and just kill a lot of stuff. We're going to be building in the dark. We're going to have to figure out how to make lights so that the thing's actually lit up. Oh. Right, so we're back. Let's start placing our walls. So we've got... Um, why can I not place one there? Is it the staircase? We'll have to figure that out. I want that to be the out... I don't want that to be like that. I want it to be the other way. Ah! Alright, so I can actually do... I can change it. 
Let me pick up the wall. Nice, so, if I press E, I can have this as the outside. There we go, cool. that that would add it to the crafting list but no I already had it in my inventory so it just made it right you're gonna have to figure out why I can't place that there because it's really annoying then we can go up and then we've got this middle bit to build and then we're gonna need to stop making walls and start making ceilings yeah. Okay, so we can only make seven of them. What are we lacking? Uh, th thatch. Yeah, I mean, makes sense. Right. So then you got. this bit of gap here. Hmm. Huh. I'm not sure how many more of these walls I'm going to want to use. Hmm. We'll have to see. I'm keeping in my inventory for now though, but I'm probably going to want to use a lot more windowed walls, for definitely for upstairs. So we'll get a little bit of regular wood as well. Yeah. And then we'll have a sort of a rough idea. We'll want to lay the... Um, we'll want to lay the... Da -da 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 -da. Words have gone out of my head. The, uh, the floor, the, the ceiling, that's what it's fucking called. Jesus Christ. We'll want to lay the ceiling first. Um, and see if we can use that to get a rough idea of where we're going to want stuff. So there we go, we can make 19 ceilings now. Okay, we're very over encumbered, what can we drop? Uh, kind of nothing really, I need it all. Shit. Oh dear. This is not going to work out well. Move. Uh, I suppose we could drop something and come back for it. And this is why I should be doing this with a pet with me. Even just something to use as a storage box for now. Well, that didn't help. Still moving super slowly. All right, we'll just waddle our way over there. So what I'm thinking is I've got windows and I'm gonna have a balcony on top of the um, workshop. And that's so I can park up any dinosaur that's full of stuff outside and I can hopefully look through the window and grab the stuff out of the dinosaur straight into the workshop. That's my thought process anyway. Um, I'm gonna have a balcony up there for if I'm riding one of the ones that have a platform saddle so I can just jump off onto the balcony. Uh, I'm going to have a door here and I've got a door at the back because I'm thinking of having a um, encompassing dinosaur pen around this area. I might use the cliffs to actually create that as well. I'm not sure yet. Um, but I'd like a pen so that at least, you know, my stuff isn't getting attacked every five seconds. And then I've got access to the water, and I've got access to stone up there, metal over there, and a lot of wood around the sort of general area. So I'm thinking 
I'm thinking it's not a bad spot. I could put some farms maybe inside the pen or outside the pen. I don't know where the best place for farming is. Um, let's get a drink while we're at the water. Picking up rocks instead, that's helpful. Let me drink. There we go. And we'll eat some food. So, obviously this is not going to be end game base. I'm probably going to end up moving. There's going to be a better location for it, for the base, that I just don't know about. Because I'm just too new at the game. But, but, it's an alright place for now. I think. And that's kind of important. Right, so I'm going to have the bedroom over here. I don't think that's going to be particularly big. It doesn't need to be particularly big. So if we have these six blocks here, basically, as your bedroom, then you've got balcony out there. So, I mean, I can replace these walls if I want to. So one, two, three, four, five... Like this, and then go across here, like this, and your doorway's there, and then have another doorway there, and there you go. So you got your bedroom, balcony. That should work. Yeah, that should be fine. Right. Let's see. Can we make another staircase? No, we don't have enough thatch, of all things. Right, let's go grab a tiny little bit more thatch. There's got to be some trees left around here that we haven't deforested. Well, we're almost, almost there. Uh, I thought I'd do more AFK stuff. Um, sorry, no, uh, not AFK. I thought I'd do more... Uh, editing on this than I have done for any of the earlier episodes, but nothing's really been edity. Although I haven't felt it. If you, if you think that I should have cut more, just let me know and I, I can do more cutting going forward. I'm fine doing that if that's what you'd prefer. Um, but I thought that this has been quite an interesting experience just getting into the mining and whatnot side of it. I'm going to. Wait, oh shit, I demolished the wrong one. I'm going to have to obviously cut it when I start uh, trying to upgrade this to stone. That, I, I am fully aware that is going to be something I do off camera, entirely off camera. Because it's going to be such a long job. Right, okay, so you work there and you work there. Right, there we go, so it works. Okay, um... Hmm. Cool. So then we need fences around the outside and... So what are these sloped walls? Right. I want to get, I want to get, uh, and that. And then roof. Sloped thatch roof. So if I do that, can I then have a sloped roof here? So it would be, it would be here that I would have this, isn't it? And then here and here like this and then I need to put I need to um, there's no way of like demolishing them from your inventory is though which is annoying I do that and then 
can't demolish. There we go. Demolish. Sloped. Sloped. Right, so we need two of each. Not quite two of each, but I'm going to make two of each just in case. I only need one of one of them, but I can't for the life of me tell you which, so. So you go there. And you go there. Then. Oh, I didn't want to make another one. Then you would go there. You would go there. Need to go get a piece of flint and then I can make a torch. And then we need more than three of these, so I'll just make three for now. Okay. Oh, excuse me. No, oh, oh dear. One, two, three. Is that enough space to walk under? Yeah, it is. All right, that works. Right, let me get a piece of flint and then we can make a torch and then I can see what the hell's going on. There we go. Torch. Craft one. Inventory. And you can go there. Right, and some of these are going to need to be changed to... Oh, God, that's bright when you're inside it. Some of these are going to need to be changed to window um, blocks to make it a little bit cooler. Right, you are sloped wall right, and so then we'll want a sloped wall left for the bathroom. Right, okay, so that's, that's going straight into the inventory, so number nine... Go there, and number zero, you go there. And we go up, and we've got our hallway and our little bedroom here. Do you know, I might, hmm, I'd be tempted to pull that back a little bit actually. Yeah, I would. I'd be tempted to make that a bit more of an outside space. Let's Demolish these. So then you've got... Oh, cool, I can hold the torch while doing this. One, two, three, four, five, and a doorway here. And then you'd need... Which slope would you need? Not that one, of course. That one. Would that work? Uh, no, it wouldn't, would it? Uh, it would if you had just a regular wall on top. If you had this here. Which I can do. And then we have another one. Is that the right one for here? It is. All right, that works. And then you there. Cool. And then we'll want doorways. And we're out of fiber. We're out of fiber. Okay. Out of fiber. Of all things. I desperately want to make one more attempt to go and reclaim our lost dinosaurs. Just one more now that I've got armor and a sword and stuff, but... So we want a door here. And a door here. So we need two doors. Okay, could you not crap in the new house I'm making? Jesus. Okay, and... One, two, bigger there. One, two. And then, we need some sort of fencing, won't we? Right, and 
some more ceilings. How much ceiling do we actually have left? Three. Yeah, not enough ceiling. One, two, three, so we need four, five, six, seven regular ceilings. What are we running out of for this stuff? Running out of thatch. That's fine. Thatch is one of the easiest things to get. There's a bunch of more trees still here. Almost there for actually building something though, which is which is nice. It's it's more than a box. You know, we built something that isn't just a flipping box. Um, and some trees. Just a little bit more thatch. Make uh, what was it seven more ceilings? It said. So we craft seven of them. Uh, no, 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 no. I think six should do now. Put another point into weight. Level sixty-five. We're almost there. Which is frustrating. <laughs> We're so close. get a bunch of thatch and then we should be should be fine we'll skip wood um, in terms of building materials and just go straight to straight to stone so then the thing should be a pretty tough little house um, and obviously change a lot of the just plain walls into some windows and stuff just to make it a little bit nicer put some window shutters in some of them and stuff yeah Okay, uh, one, two, three, four. Really? Do you not line up? Why do you not line up? Oh, you are fucking me. Why would you not line up? Um, sloped. I don't know why they don't line up. Ugh. But it frustrates me. Yeah, look, they just don't... They're not lining up for some reason. There's a gap. But there isn't a gap there, but there is a gap here. Why is the... I don't know. And then there's not really any gaps here either. It's really weird. That is really strange. I don't understand that. Okay, so... One, two, and... Alright, alright, alright. You're gonna whinge about it, Jesus. Um, come on. Three, there we go. Right, so here's the bathroom. Here's our hall slash probably kitchen area, to be honest. Started talking about the kitchen and he got really hungry. Yeah, here's our sort of kitchen area that we'll probably use. As, yeah, we'll use this area as a kitchen area, maybe. Because we've got a bit of a, a bit of space here and some space under here. And then we've got another little hallway up here. And our bedroom. And obviously we have forgotten to implement some walls up here. So we need one of those, and then we need a sloped wall left, I think. Let's see how correct I was there. Space is obstructed. Um, 
moment. Space is still obstructed. Wonderful. Ah, oh, that was the wrong thing. So you can go there, and then... Thankfully we have another doorway to put down. No, stop building stuff when I don't want you to. And then you go there. And then you go there. And we need one more of these to go there. Still don't know why this one has a gap. No idea at all, to be honest with you. I, if I wanted to get rid of it, I suppose I could just put um, an actual corridor wall here, like this. If I really don't like it. Which I actually really don't like it, so. I could just do that, and then if I really wanted else, I could also put a door there. Or just even a doorway, just a, just a hole. Uh, there's not enough stuff, so let's just put a couple of these down and then demolish them. Let's see if that gives me enough to craft it. It does not! Just because I've got too many walls, so demolishing them to get the resources to make another one makes sense in my little head. There we go. <laughs> it was easier than going out and doing stuff. Uh, to match it, it'd have to be that way, yeah. Right. There we go. So we have bedroom, hallway, beautiful balcony where we can watch the red sunset. I mean, if I wanted to, the balcony could actually. Ex actually, that's a good idea. That's cool. We could... could extend it like this a little bit, couldn't you? That's cool. I like that. Yeah. Why not? Why not have a slightly extended bash, uh, balcony? Can we make one more? No. Right. And that is... Basically it, I think. It's just to, it's just upgrading it and filling it with um, the required stuff, basically. But overall, I'm fairly content with it. Uh, I'm not actually sure how I, how I like how that bar if I actually like how that balcony looks. But we'll play around with that later. So that is. All I have time for for today, I'm going to upgrade this um, off camera to stone because it's just going to be an absolute ton of trips up the hill, back down the hill, up the hill, back down the hill. So that's just going to be really boring. So I'm going to do that off camera and then hopefully we will pick up next episode with a set up house ready to maybe go and explore some more of the dangerous areas in the map. Thank you very much for watching and goodbye.